Bob, if I can call you Bob, and that is your name. <laughs> You're writing a book about your life. I, I, I and am. and I, I, I'm hoping, because I'll be the first in line to get that book, that there'll be some <laughs> full house stories in there that are behind the scenes and scandalous. And they're Anything, because not... you have a dirty mind, you know? <laughs> well, you do, he does. I'm not, I'm telling you the truth. I, I think everybody does, kind of, except. Oh, not like you. Not like you, Bob. <laughs> I don't mean it. No, I'm no, actually, yeah, you're a good guy, I, I, uh, but you, your mind goes sometimes to dirty places. I'm picturing you both in a hotel room right now, and I'm <laughs> just kind of wedged like a hydro because that gets what very is little. What is happening there? Well, you guys were, <laughs> but you were doing that. You said you were kind of tangent. I don't remember any of that. Anyway, uh, um, <laughs> so yeah, uh, doing a sitcom for family stuff has residualed with me. Um, and in the book, I'm actually writing about it. We had a live donkey on the show once, which people might have seen that uh, episode. I forgot it. I was right. like, I don't know, on NyQuil or something that year. But um, we had a there, live... There was an episode of Full House where there's a, a donkey on the set. A live donkey called Eeyore, mm-hmm. which was a great name to come up with it. Um, yeah. And then the donkey with a studio audience, and it was like full air conditioning and stuff. I don't know if this has ever happened here, but the donkey <laughs> got excited in front of the audience, and it, 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 it got an erection yeah. in front of the... Now, I don't know if it's ever happened here. Yes. <laughs> and you, you We've got had it. animals you got, here. And, I, th- and I thought you, made, you have a desk, so no one would know. That's what I. <laughs> There's a reason this thing is bolted down. Let's put it that way. I, I, I am. I am dirty. Apparently, I am dirty. Yeah. No. No. Not at all. So all right, far. All right. So let's talk about. So the let's do- talk about the donkey erection. All again. right. <laughs> Well, it got, it got aroused, and I didn't know what to do because there were kids there. The kids were younger, sure. and, and, and John Stamos, uh, handsome yogurt man, and uh, <laughs> like a, he's like a sister to me. And, yeah. and Dave, Dave, Dave Coulier, the yeah. other friend, was Joey. Uh, we were standing there, and the kids were young, and I didn't know what to do, so I started to call the thing Peppermill instead of Eeyore because it, it looked like, you know, when you go to Olive Garden and you get fresh ground pepper? <laughs> you know, it looked like the whole... It looked like a Peppermill. It looked like a Peppermill. Yeah. So I said... So I was saying that. So to diffuse the situation around children, yes. you okay. started yelling, Pepper Mill, Pepper Mill. Because I, I, I wanted to help the children. Yeah. Uh, and, right. pr- and protect them. Sure. But this, this is what is in the book, stuff like that, that stayed with me, because this is a true thing. I will be in a restaurant, and I will get a Caesar salad, and the guy will come over, and he'll go, would you like some fresh ground pepper? And I'll just go, you get that thing away from me. That is, that is, a, that is a donkey s- Okay, what, what the hell are you doing? What are you doing? Well, thank you. What are you doing? I don't know. I mean, you got, you got audio people. They can do things. No, no, no. We can't afford to do that. Uh, <laughs> that's going out to all of America.